take a shot at the enemy. I'm gonna make it to the top, leave a legacy. If I got something to say, you better let me speak. Turn it up a new degree, bitch, you ain't seen anything. I pop box with the new rock, electronic, but it's on the group up. I'm too honest when I take a few shots. They're too toxic, need to take the new song. Everything I've been chasing Fall here for the taking Don't wanna test your luck with me I think I've had enough to see I'm sick of all the bad thoughts People who won't have fun When nights talk Sideways in front of me. Ooh. I just saw the C splits on the on the radar in front of me. Oh my god! A couple of BMWs just. I just made it a little bit closer to the club. I've been creeping, man. Three wide into turn one. <laughs> Stage is definitely playing to your left there. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Come on, you're gonna have to play right, shot. Go you're for gonna have to play shot. They're gonna be back right corner. Check the right, right side. Right, right, right. Up on top. Yes! Nice. Back right, you saw her! Back right. Oh, 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 four! Four! four, four. Oh, hold it! Let's go! It's insane! No Let's go! Way. On target, Sarves there for the save, bangs it downfield. It's gonna get cut off, going for the catch. Gets bumped here, but doesn't get knocked off course. Picks this one up, great dribble, what a flick. Just under crossbar, Sarve, great shot.
How about now? Is it not muted? Yeah, okay. Well, hey, there you go. Yeah. Um, I had it muted the other night when I was recording um, scrims for one of the teams. That way I didn't have all the background noise in their scrim, all I got was their comms. Gotta remember to recheck that box on OBS when you're done. But how you two doing? Good to see you. I made a joke, said uh, you guys must be really bored because no one comes and watches me. So that got ruined. That's still at full health. I can take I can take one hit on this thing. Probably not now. I think that's what two, three layers. I feel like that's uh you're getting smacked in the head kind of ratio there. Okay, perfect.
we should be fine with this. Um, I don't know if either one of those are better than the other, but we'll just tackle it. The three tackles should work. Yeah, he didn't do enough damage to really make much of a difference there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the first time I've looked at this game since we strained it last week. Mainly since I've been building my team for Chufti's, uh Pokemon League. I have all of them but one. Ted Pokemon, I have nine of them ready. I do have to get some more bottle caps to finish, like, EV training a couple of them. But they have moves, they have items, they have their Terra type, and they have their nature all set. Technically, I could all raise all of their levels to 100 still, too, and... Um, I probably will eventually, but for the most part, they're ready, and I just need to get one more Pokemon. I gotta get that one off of Wise, and then we are ready to go. So depending on when I can get it off of him, maybe tonight before he goes to bed, uh, we should be ready f tomorrow. I gotta figure out, like, I don't know how they do, like, which gym leaders are open and, like, all that. But I gotta figure out which ones I can, um, message in battle. I think you get to do one a week. Or something like that. I know some of these people are gonna go super sweaty. They're gonna go, like, full VGC. They're gonna have one restricted, two semi-restricteds. And then a bunch of other like really strong non-restricted ones and i'm just like and i like this one and this one's also cool i'm trying to think i do have stuff like well i don't want to actually i have I'm trying to think i think i've got like off the top of my head, I've got three or four that I know have been uh, in VGC, like, seen before. Actually, at least half my team has been in, in the VGC scene at, at some point since their initiation into the games. One, I think, is still super relevant. But I think either way, it's going to be a lot of fun just building a team of 10 Pokemon and trying to see uh, how far into the league we can go will be fun. I think I've got types pretty, pretty well balanced. And I've made sure to put a mixture of offensive, defensive, attack, and versus special attack. I think, I think we're going to be solid. It's just a matter of me trying to figure out um, the gym leaders in like what order to fight them. I'm probably going to do the obscure ones later, I think. Like, Ghost, like, what was it? I think one's, like, Ghost, Dark, Poison. Like, that one's going to be pretty easy to, like, build a team around. Versus Tropical Theme. It's, like, now I got to go look through all the Pokemon and try to think of what's a tropical-looking Pokemon. And figure out the best way to build a team around that. Almost level nine. I don't really. I guess I could level. Well, we gotta fight the girl, I think. We didn't fight. We didn't fight this little girl over here. I don't think. Uh, yeah, we didn't fight her. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, Molly. With her purloin. Which is a dark touch. I should just throw in, um. Wellington. What's his name? So we fight this guy. Or girl. We fight the two kids. And then we have the gym leader, so we can push everything to like 11 after this fight. And then anyone that's not 13 after the second kid in the um, gym, we will uh, just push everybody to 13 then. Beautiful. So Waddle. Okay. Um. I feel like you have to go back. Wait, isn't he? Isn't he normal? Yeah, 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 yeah. We just do this. We just go to this guy. Pago, pago. Which one does that do? Five? Yeah, I think we're good here. Uh, water gun. Okay, whatever. It's slow assist. No big deal. That did, oh yeah, yeah, we don't. She'll, she'll get over it. I'm sitting over there for two days. I think I might have put myself in a bit of a bind here. Tackle? Three? I don't know how much damage Bug Bite does. Is it just neutral? Oh, it's not neutral. It's just super effective. Well, I'm glad that he didn't use Bug Bite into the um, dark type. She won't re-heal. Uh, she only heals us that one time. Right. Hate ignore Alder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll get to you in a second. Um, I don't know how I'm going to raise up Azrael's friendship really this early. It's kind of a weird mon to have early. Healing it, I guess, constantly will help. Is there anything we can buy that would help with that? Pokeball and potion? No. What does this guy sell? Like mail or something? Yeah. Writing a reply, writing questions, writing a thank you note, writing invitations, things, introductory greetings. This is so weird. The mail stuff looks so funny. Alright, so the first one he's going to put in will be, I think, the one that's weak against. Oh man, what is it? Which one does he do? He does the weak, the one that's weak. That we're weak to first. I think he does. I think it's this one. I think we do. He does fire first, and then he does. Uh, water. If I remember right. I'll show you what's cool about my Pokemon. Sure. 
Right, I did, I did this right. Pampor. Oh no, we do weak, weak against first, and then strong against this. Dang, I had it backwards. I mean, it was a 50-50 shot, right? Um, so let's do Snivy. Tobias, quit running in the house. Take your running shoes from you. Make a Professor Oak sign and put my face on it. And just there's a time and a place for this. It's just posted in the house. I like that sound. <laughs> it makes it's just like he's got lassoed to the mouth. Yeah, yeah, heal our Pokemon. The one that we're not going to use this fight. <sighs> Water gun's stronger. Bad thing is, like, I don't have anything to swap into because I have two that are weak to fire. Holy shit. Azrael is so weak. Uh, I think it can go one more. Okay. It did 12. So crit would kind of screw us up here. So let's let's just swap out. Maybe he leers. Okay, scratch does six. Perfect. No scratch on our own. Now he's gonna leer. So six is gonna go to like probably what ten. And we kill it. Perfect. Beautiful. Yeah, he has a 9 attack die. Yeah, he's kind of weak right now. I don't remember what any of their uh, natures are. Wait, what's this? There's like Pokeballs up there. I want those Pokeballs, man. And then here's the metal guy who I don't really know anything about. Yay, got a case for some metals. Can I get like Lorna Shore and Ginger Metal? Oh no, crappy baby metal. God, Alder, stop talking to me, please. He couldn't have said that, like, inside. It says that there's, like... It says there's a way to get, like, a Dratini or, uh... Which uh, Gibble in here in this town, but I don't know where the heck you would even do that at. I feel like that's a post game thing. So let's let's do some research real quick. Um, Pokemon database. We got Purloin. We got Azrael. We have Snivy, and we have Swaddle. Okay. 
Gen 5, black 2, white 2. So if we're looking at this here. Okay, so Waddle, okay, done. We don't we don't get any moves with him before uh, this fight's over. Black 2, white 2. We get Sand Attack and Fury Swipe, so we definitely want to get him to 10. If this is right, we get Sand Attack at 10. Which is good. Fury Swipes is okay. But Sand Attack makes it where the... And I think we use this one, we use, save this one specifically for the second guy. I think we can beat the first one just by, just by playing. Alright. Bubble Beam Charm. Charm is not bad. Charm's minus two stages of attack. But she has that um stupid bulk up move. I don't know what the move is actually called. Work up, maybe? Is it called work up? Yeah, it's this one. Yeah, it raises your attack and special attack by one stage. It's got 30 PP. I wonder if we could counter charm it. Like, just keep... He's only got 20, but he'd have to use a lot of his stuff to counter that. So, Charm is actually not bad here. And then he's got Growth. Which is, what, two special attacks? Oh, it's one special and one... Uh, Oh, it's one for each, and then if it's in harsh sunlight, it gets two. Okay, that's where I thought what the two was. Okay, so we, we get some decent moves. So that's not terrible at all. Alright, let's get them to... Uh... 11. Um... This weekend, the move weakens fire types moves. Well, he's not going to use water sport. Like, he's already strong against fire types. Makes no sense. Okay. So he's got good bulk. If he's not fighting something he's weak against, he just his attack stats aren't that great right now. He's pretty solid, too. The only thing this one's got going for it's like speed, honestly. There's our sand attack. Okay, it's kind of high speed. It's kind of balanced. Wrap isn't terrible. He's got good speed, good special defense, but we're not going to be fighting special defense. Alright. So thinking about this defense 14 20 17 and 11 this one's the weakest hmm I'm she's got the weakest defense of everybody on the team maybe we start with her sand attack in and then head into, um, like, this guy, Vine Whip and stuff. And then we can finish the set off with... Azrael goes in on the second guy, charms a couple of times, throws it over to him, and he just bug bites him down, I guess. Maybe. Or maybe we... Oh, man. It's so difficult. Because the first thing they're going to do is probably work up. So, technically, I could do Charm on the first guy. Switch over to... Like, Snivy. Then Snivy can finish the first guy off. 
The second guy comes in, he wants to start bulking. You throw um, the cannon, try to sand attack twice or three times while he's bulking, and then you throw. Another person in. Might as well give everyone an Orion Berry. Everyone's full health because we didn't fight, right? Beautiful. Let's get all this boring talking out. I think, I think once we get past this guy, we'll we'll be doing all right. The thing that really screws this first fight over is the inability to have something that's strong against normal types. Like you can't get. The fighting type to fight him. And you're level locked. So, like, even if I had a Pokemon that could use a fighting type move, none of them get a fighting type move before 13. So, I'm trying to think of like the two, like, Riolu, of course, is the best thing. Because while they're trying to bulk up themselves, like you just you just smack them away and they're done. So I lose like one stage. He uses like two. Not terrible. <laughs> Critical hit. Minus four attack. I might. I was what minus two defense, but still minus four attack. That dude crits for like twenty two damage. Well, we don't have to worry about Azrael and Charm and trying to level up its friendship and all that. Huh. Okay. So that's the two Pokemon they're gonna use: is Lollipop and Patrat. So now you just did. I think he did six damage to us there. Well, let's scroll down and put a death counter on. Nope. Oh. Oh, we didn't even put Pago Pago up as our fourth. Well, let's add him as our uh, save. Pago Pago. Let's give him a proper. Farewell. So we put him on our team for a second there. Just because he deserves to be on the team at least once, right? Oh, it's straight back and then over. Alright, and then when we put him in the box, we will take him back off of our stuff over there. 
Well, it wasn't meant to be Pago Pago. You should have been a Riolu. Nope, you don't need the Oran Berry where you're going. Having Azumarill would have been pretty cool though. Having like, even if he does, a, a Belly Drum would be kind of risky, but you could totally do a Belly Drum, like Citrus Berry or something. Belly Drum with like Shell Bell. All right, Pogo Pogo. Bye-bye. It was nice having you for like two fights. And you being completely useless in both of those. Pat Rat, though, that thing is stupid growth. That's like the third time a Pat Rat has crit me for like three quarters of my health. Alright, so this is Wellington, this is Sawaddle. He's got... Alright, so this is with a two level advantage. I took six damage. I dealt half of his, with a single bug bite. It's not bad. Alright. Same thing with the power rat. I got two levels on it. Okay. So they're doing six damage to me. What level does Sawaddle re evolve at? I forget. SEW. 20. Okay. And then I gotta get friendship to get this final form. Perfect. Almost bedtime. All right, so let's get everybody to 13 now. Okay, so he's really fast. Growth, we use growth instead of growl or whatever, right? Yeah. Um, actually, no, I think growth over wrap. Vine Whip and Tackle are pretty useful, and so is Leer. Fury Swipes, though, can be removed, can remove, like, assist. I think assist is kind of bad overall. I could be wrong in that, but... And this dude is so bulky. As long as he's not fighting something like a flying or a fighting type or a fire type, I think his bulk's gonna be pretty nice. Alright, so shoot, I'm trying to think. The best way to tackle this I think we go Snivy first and just like vine whip this guy down. Then Then we do uh, 
We go into Purloin on the first turn of the second guy. Sand attack twice. Switch into Sawaddle and try to use Sawaddle to win the fight. If Sawaddle can't, then we pivot back over to Snivy and let Snivy finish it. That's what I'm thinking. Like we have two levels on them. So attack and special attack. Okay. I'm gonna hit him with a vine weapon, just see how much damage that does. Half, half his health? Okay, so his his shit doesn't matter now, at this point. We might just let Snipey just wipe this. Because it's over half health. This guy dies. The next guy is coming out. The Lillipup's going to come out. Right? He's going to use Workup on his first turn, so we use uh, another Growth. And then we should be able to two-shot it. No, three-shot it, maybe. Because it's 13. Tackled first. Okay, so it does 10. Alright. Okay, now he works up. Uh, 10 plus... Man, I really want to go for another hit. But I think we switch... Hmm... I wish I knew how to do the calculator things. Like how much damage it would do. I feel like 10, I mean, a, on 10 a crit would be like 20. Like could be like 20 damage, right? 20 plus. So now that the base damage is more than 10, a crit could kill us. We don't really want to lose Snivy. I think we switched into the bulkier Wellington here. Let Wellington just deal with it. Yeah, tackle. 15? Oh shit, yeah, 15. That's insane. Okay. They got us, what, 10 more? switch into Cairo I feel like this Cairo should be faster as long as she doesn't die here oh he's got a potion as long as she doesn't die here we should be fine uh, sand attack because we are faster hopefully he misses okay what is that nope critical hit because of course because why wouldn't it? Uh, Snivy's got to be our choice. It's so unlucky. This fight is so dumb. I mean, I have to just find Whip because if I switch straight over to the other guy, we just die hoping for a crit. Okay. We win. So we lose we lose Purloin. Right? Or did we lose Sawaddle? I can't I don't even know which one I just killed. So stupid though. Also this sucks that we didn't get Lillipup, Marie, Riolu, Psyduck. Like any one of those would have been better than Azrael. Man. Workup's actually pretty, like, insane. Oh, yeah, this is the generation where TMs are just like. Yeah, it was Cairo. Man. I actually like Purloin. Purloin's kind of cool. 
the ability to get a dark type like right off the bat is pretty neat. I kind of feel like I'm also screwing myself because of the um, the season that it's in. I don't know why it's in winter though. Like it's it's going by my computer. It's April, which should be spring. my rival. Hey, we can't do sea gear, but... So it just has to sit as it sits like that. All right. Sorry, Cairo. It was nice knowing you. Alright, so now we have to move that to that. And we're not moving Wellington up. We're just leaving Wellington where he's at. The next Pokemon we catch will just go in that empty spot. Alright. I do believe that puts us going to Burbank City next? Which... If this is right, like, Burbank City has only water. There's Burbank Complex, Caselia City, and Caselia Sewers. If I can get to the Caselia stuff, we might be doing decent. Where's my house? Do I have a house over here somewhere? Like, do I get to talk to mom? Tell her like, hey, I'm going. Yeah, 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 this is my house. I could have just done that instead of went to the Poké Center. Cool. And there's like nothing. Man, I can't play on the Wii. Oh god. This house is over here. Mm. These towns are so 
boring. See, I can fish right there if I had a fishing rod. Like, nobody in any of these towns, like, interesting. Yeah, see, that's, that's your rival's town. Or house. people have anything good to say. Sick. Hopefully this is where I'm supposed to go, is back up this way. And it's a Torloid. We could get a shiny one, but I'm not going to sit there and, like, farm for it. I mean, I wouldn't farm for it, but I sit there and run around the grass like leveling up and shit to find one that'd be so lame um yeah that probably would be smart Oh, no, I know, I, I'm, I'm overthinking it. I know exactly where I have to, well, after this talk here. Habitat list? Okay. Oh, that just tells you where they live, right? Oh, check which Pokemon are in the area. Okay. Maybe we gotta go down there. Well, this guy let's go by now. It's a basic badge. Oh. This dude just wants to fight. Okay. You got it like a. <laughs> Seriously? Aren't you a dickhead? Hey, you know the one Pokemon that's really good against this gym leader? Yeah, I have it. Six damage, okay. Endure that. I don't think you can use Endure when it's that low, right? Okay, so it's like reverse of, uh, it's basically false swipe. Like, it will let you not, what? It's on, like, 1 HP. Even if you're already on 1 HP, you can't be killed? That's kind of stupid. Oh, also, let's look up. Uh, level cap goes to 18. And we have one badge. It's a basic bitch badge. Oh, and death, I guess, is technically now two. There we go. Man, I might have to beat up a preschooler. And the fact that our level cap is 18, that means that Swaddle will still be Swaddle in this after up to this first or the second gym leader. Not until we get our second badge will it be able to evolve. Snivy will be a second uh, stage though. That won't be terrible. Oh my god. 
can can y'all just leave me alone and let me just go? Yes, yeah, tall dark grass. It's rare, but sometimes two Pokemon pop out at the same time. Also, the Pokemon that hide in dark grass are slightly stronger, so be careful if you walk through it. Petra berries. That's. I don't remember what Petra berries do. Poison? Maybe? Okay, great ball. Now. Oh, they gave me frustration and return. Okay, that's kind of neat. It is poison. Okay. And this is still Route 20. Ugh. Okay, so we got Bank, Burbank City, Burbank Complex, Liberty Garden, Cave of Being, Poke Studios, the ranch. Okay, so we can get maybe something in the city, the complex, the garden. Which one's Caselia? Oh, so we can't go to this place until after. Alright, look guys, I am so tired of seeing Lillipub. Y'all got to find something, something better. to do okay another purloin nice I'm sure this girl right here wants to fight yep you see she's gonna like beat up kids Nursery aid, Kimya. Dun's farce. <sighs> Before it had an evolution, but still shit either way. Shit. That should hurt. I didn't think about rollout. 
<laughs> he's like, you know what? I got a rock type move for this bug. Cool, more money. A double battle? No fucking way. Because I can't do a whole lot to him. Let him bug bite these guys. Oh shit, I guess he just kills them straight up. Okay. One? I wasn't thinking I had like a 5 level advantage on them either. So, I guess the 5 level advantage made it much easier just to tackle than to bug bite on the other one. Cool, more Pokeballs. That's great. Now we're in Riverbank City. Oh my god, this game is so annoying. Sure. No, I just walked in the fucking town. Like. What do you mean, you fucking watching me? Like, got the Life360 app on me? Boom, she got you there. Dim witted, dense, dumb, daft, dippy, dorky, doltish, doofus. The guy in the miner suit looks like he's probably useful for something, right? Man, that makes me sad that I only have two Pokemon there. Okay, so what can I buy? Well, first we're gonna sell. We don't need X Attack. We don't need Dire Hit. So what can we buy now? Can we buy repels yet? Oh shit, yeah. Let's buy two of those, because we never know when we're going to need those. And let's buy like... Oh, that's way too many. Let's just buy like five. I can buy seven. Hmm... You know what? We've got plenty of like Pokeballs and Great Balls. I think that's fine. Yeah, we got like 17 Pokeballs plus all the Great Balls. I think we're good. Uh. All right, let's do a little bit of exploring. See if there's any sort of like Pokemon we can get in town.
pokey toy. I'm not sure I even know what that does. Allows you to flee. Okay. I guess that's cool. Alright, so I can't go there. Okay. Old guy. Battle box? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Got it. So this is where I need to go when I'm ready to leave. It's over here. Poison? Oh, no way. What's this? Is this the complex? Oh, this is the gym. Okay. That's kind of cool. It looks like a secret club. Like, it, like, not really, I guess, a secret club, but you're going into, like, a club. That's actually kind of cool that, that it's a super unique Zekrom? Okay. That's nice, Grandma. Okay. Where's this complex? I want to go to the complex. We have to find a com the complex. A Magnemite would be sick, though. Burn heal. Okay. Antidote in the trash. Why would someone throw away some useful? What's this say? Oh, this is the complex? Alright, so now it says I can go into my Pokedex. Right? And I can click Habitat, and it tells me what type of Pokemon. What? That's it? Pat Rat and Padov? So Route 19 is just... So, it's Pat Rat and Perlin, and Perlin's like the harder of the two. Okay. Then 20, you have... Dove, Dunsparce. Appreciate it, Tank. How you doing, buddy? Ah, uh, and then the ranch. You really want the Riolu. Riolu is like the best option there, but it and Mareep are really far, hard to get. The complex literally has Padov and fucking Patrat. No way. Why was the guy saying about a Magnemite? Is he smoking?
Hmm. What's this? Oh shit. Cut? Okay. Okay, so let's look at this real quick. Oh, I guess I could bring the whole thing. That's just the... So it says the complex has all of these Pokemon in it. It does have Magnemite listed. Magby, Mad, Coughing, Audino, Glalith. Kingler. I feel like the water types are going to be only if I have, like, Surf or something. So we have, like, Patrat, Padov, Magnemite, Magby. I wish it told me, like, the uh, percentages there. Um, so let's do this. Let's look at Verbank Complex, Yanova. Yep, that place. Um, inside, outside. Okay, inside I have a chance of Magnemite, Magby, Double Grass. Maybe we find the Double Grass. Magby, Growlithe, Magnemite. Magnemite's the one we want, no matter how you look at it. Yeah, Surfing, Super Rod are the water types. But outside we definitely don't want to go. We don't want to see anything outside because that's got Padova and Patrat as like the highs. But Magby and Elicate. Well, we don't. We can't get Elicate because we have a uh, black. So we get Magby. So Magnemite and Magby are the two commons inside. Okay. I did. I had my finger on the wrong button. I was trying to go down to Bug Bite. Whatever. I guess he's slower. He did eight damage on that too. Crazy. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. We'll play for. We'll do this little area. We'll try to get our catch and then um, get ready for the second gym leader. And then we'll play the second gym sometime this week. Maybe Thursday if I don't have to do any um, scrim recording that day if so that's fine but that's kind of neat you get to do that this is probably one of the workers please don't have like magnemite I literally wouldn't be, won't be able to do anything with it Okay, patch trap, we can we can handle this. I can just see them going Magnemite. You need to have the Magmar to be able to do something about it. Bite. Okay. Tackle. I see we also have Razor Leaf now, so that's good. Razor Leaf is solid. Yeah, bite this. Other kid. Alright, let's see how much Razor Leaf does. I think Razor Leaf should do pretty good bit of damage. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and be safe and swap. I don't know what kind of moves Elekin has. Low kick. I think this game is kind of neat that it's got Elekid, Magby, and 
Azrael, like three baby Pokemon that are normally kind of hard to get, like regular fucking encounters right off the bat. Yeah, get to work. No fucking around. Yeah, there's a worker guy right there. I guess this is just a fight. Okay, whatever. There's a dude down there, so we gotta go down there and fight him. That's probably where we end up getting our encounter. Waylon? Like Waylon Jennings? Good lord. Fucking pat rats, man. This is one Pokemon I can not wait to never see again. I can't wait to never see again. Something like that, yeah. I fucking hate this Pokemon. It's literally the last two times I've opened this game up. That thing is crit for like 25 damage. Is there a way to like fall off? Answered my own question. Yes. Riolu. Bug's good against fighting. I can't remember. I want to find out. Nope. Do bugs are bugs weak to fighting? Then? Or am I just like misthinking that? Bug. These types are... Okay, so bugs weak to fire, flying, and rock. So bug is not good against... It's like bugs aren't good against fighting types. Which I guess makes sense. And then fighting types are also not good against bug types. Yeah, there we go. We got a crit in our favor this time. Oh, fuck it, we're just gonna use Razor Leaf again. I wish I had more Pokemon to level up. Alright. This will be our encounter. Yep, I knew that there would be something there. Magnemite. Coughing? Fuck. Alright. We have to look up what coughing has. Otherwise, we might get screwed here. So. Coughing. Pokedex. Moves learned. Gen 5. Black 2, white 2. According to this, tw level 12, he should have Assurance, Smokescreen, Smog, and then at level 1 he has Poison Gas and Tackle. So I'm assuming he has Tackle, but he does have Smog, which is very dangerous to us. Um... We just have to tackle them. Smoke screen. Turn all those accuracy. Bug is weak to poison? Question mark. No. Yeah, there we are. 
it's flying rock and fire flying rock and fire but grass is weak to um, poison so technically he could use a grass uh, poison pipe move and we'd still take a bunch of damage because it's uh, grass piping all right looks like we're taking a coughing home with us or not all right so let's do this we bug bite because it won't finish bug bite because it does less damage and it shouldn't kill it so it should weaken it enough to put it yeah there we go Pokemon slot number two. Um, coughing is like somewhere in the middle here. Where is he? I don't. S Wait. I see Grimer and Muck. Where's coughing and wheezing? the fuck? Um. Oh, there he is. 109. Perfect. Um. So we gotta name it after a capital city. What's one of Do we just go into like the United States? Like what's uh what's one of our you know this is gonna be New York City. And we're just gonna call them NYC. I I'm already I'm already just gonna Right. Good enough. I was gonna do like California, but like LA is not the capital of California. I don't know how bad Sacramento is. So this guy's just gonna be NYC. His New York's got a bunch of like pollution and shit too. Now, I think we switch NYC in gentle nature plus is that plus special defense minus defense? If the target's taken damage this turn, this power is doubled. Okay. Smog can poison. And then we have tackle and smoke screen. It's not a bad move set. My trusty Woobat? Oh, fuck. Woobat's psychic and flying mother fucker if this thing oh my god now i gotta look this up this starting point on this game is so brutal why is it why is it like this all right so this is level 13 assurance is dark gust confusion and odor sleuth <laughs> mother fucker oh man well this could be the end of us here. 
Actually, we just smog it, right? See if we can poison the bastard. Gust. Okay. Doesn't do a lot. Yep. Okay. Poison it. Fuck. Alright, we have to put in... Snivy, because Wellington comes into a gust, he's four times weak to that shit. He will get obliterated. Snivy might too, but at least Snivy has a chance of surviving it. 35. Okay, 14. Um, we have to tackle, because Vine Whip's not going to do enough damage. Okay. Critical hit. Fuck it, we got we got a ball in it. And we're dead. Okay, bye bye Snivy. Dude, this this starting area is fucking stupid. Here's the most dog shit Pokemon in the game. In all the games. With a very odd chance of getting something useful like Mareep or Riolu. Good luck. Oh, you have two grass types? Guess what? This area has four poison types and flying types. Well. Okay, I see what I gotta do. I gotta go up and then I gotta go down to the other side here. Hopefully this guy has something that just finishes us off, and we're gonna go pick fucking Tepig next time. Tepig's second form is a uh, fighting type, or is just his third? I can't remember. I'm looking it up. No. Yeah, he gets to be fighting type in his second form, which he gets at 17, which you get right before the um. Like you get 17 before the end of this fight, so that would actually be useful. Yeah, that's the end of this run, folks. Because Magby's just gonna use Ember again, and then this guy's just fucked. All right, we have to look up and how figure out how to beat Charon without losing anybody, because that's really what's screwing us. Having four Pokemon and then losing two of them to Charon. Or one to the random fucking pat rat right before. So stupid. Yep, there's coughing. Alright, well. Just smog us, please. Oh, no, not. Oh, that's gonna do a lot of damage. Shit's hilarious. I should be going back to the. I should be healing in between fights and shit, too. But at this point, I'm like, this. Having two grass types is just dumb. Snivy's not a good choice. Okay, so what's down here? Beef. That's not bad. It doesn't do anything for us in this like area. Okay, that's just a wall. It looked like he was thinking of going over that. This guy's over here just like talking to nothing. I'm sure he's a battle too. Rock Smash. Okay. That's pretty useful. So this is also the complex. Trade your Pokeball for my Great Ball. 
Yep, that is a good deal. Burbank City. Okay. That's such a weird trade. How do I get over that? I guess I have to swim or something. I think, honestly, we just kill this run because Wellington's not going to survive the poison gym by himself, and I get nothing else. Nothing else before this fight. We've already killed off Azrael, or Pago Pago, and we've killed Cairo. We've killed off Comping. We've killed off San Jose. Yeah, I think... I think we just do this number here. And then... What is it? Up. Select B. Yep. All right. We'll call it here too, cause it's getting late, and I gotta get up early and go to work and shit. So run six. We're gonna go ahead and set up the um, sprite for it. That's Gen four. We need. Gen 5, we're going to get the Tepig. Little Tepig there. Boom. Wait, don't I have... Wait, I never mind. I'm so dumb. I have a save state for this. Yeah. So this is run counter. So this is run number 6. Um, level cap goes back to 13, sadly. Deaths go back to zero, and badges go back to zero. Now, the question is, does my bag have... Okay, so we'll have to redo the bag info. Okay, let me do that real quick. Let's see. Um, I need to put PK Hex on the um, main thing here. Where is my save file for this? Um, oh, here it is. So let's do this. Let's save state this as save state one. All right, then I need to open save state one. Should be this one. Yeah. Items in there in medicine. Handy. And export to C. 
say to that. Overwrite. Okay. Now if I load that, it should have in medicine, right? Or do I have to like... Oh, no, no, no. I know what I did. Oh, shit. I, I dumb fucked it all. I know how to, uh, what I'm supposed to do. I... I up select B. We'll get it set here. Nope. That's A. Alright, we'll get this all set up. We'll, uh... I have to s save the game in the game for it to be the save state, I think. Because the save state in this, this save state, doesn't isn't the same as the one I'm doing. We'll delete this. So we'll get this all run through. We're changing it. I guess I'll make it J now. J's arrival. This guy better not get like a hoopla. Then I'm really fucked. Alright, once I get my bag, I should be able to save the game and then overwrite that save. And we should be fine. Make sure we have all of the, uh, Make sure we have all of the stuff that we need. God, there's like, come on, just let me skip this shit. Nobody wants to watch this bullshit. Also, that sucks that. There's no way at the beginning of the game to go into the options and change the speed text fast. I guess I could.
I forgot I could do the speed thing. Just speed this shit up. Alright, so 952. I want to make sure that this... So if I, like, leave and come back in... Does that say I saved it at 952? It does. Okay, perfect. So now, open this save state here. Items. Medicine. Candy. Save. And then export the save. There's that one right there. Okay, so now I should be able to load it from right there. I should have rare candies now, even though that's all I have in my bag. Right? Boom. Okay, perfect. We did it right. That's all. That's all we needed to make sure is that's that's set. All right. All right, let's let's go ahead and get to the part where we walk up to the thing right before we get our Pokemon. Let's just skip all this dumb shit for now. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, make a copy of that. I'm going to put a copy of it in this. Yeah, there we go. So I have a copy of it in a different folder so it doesn't mess with this save file. And then this will be where we have our basically our save state like this. All right. Well, that was fun. Um, tomorrow we open, so we might we might play some more tomorrow, we, or we might see about the uh, Chefty League stuff. What's uh, the first gym leader that we're gonna go after, and make an effort on that. Let me look real quick. Um, let me copy and paste these, but let me get rid of the, um, I just really want the, I just need for us to be able to look at it. I just want what each gym leader does and kind of need to know which ones are gym leaders. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm wondering if this is the um, split here. Okay, let's do copy. Um, I guess we could put it into like a Google Doc real quick. all that um Google Doc. all right so these are the um the names of the people we have so 
So this is the team that they have against to go up against. I'm thinking, man, see, like, Steel Rock would be probably actually the best one for me. Because, like, I know I have a Water type and a Fire type. That would be pretty good against it. Grass. Do I have Grass? I do have Grass. Actually, no. If I can go up against Attica first, Attica would be pretty good. Psychic and Fairy. Which is kind of annoying because you would want to use Dark, but Dark's weak to Fairy. And then Fairy, you could use um, Poison types, but then Poison types are weak to Psychic. This one could be pretty easy. Flying and Psychic do Electric and Ice. Have Electric and Ice, then have... um. Dark, darker bug, there. Normal and dragon. I think I think that one will be. Steel rock could be annoying. Starters. Starters could be pretty annoying depending on what typings of the the secondary typings of them. Fairy grass. You just do poison. You just have a poison type. Right. Fighting Steel, so this guy's using a, um, he's definitely got, uh, Lucario. Dragon Fire, that's, um, Turtonator, I think. Dark Ghost Poison, well, he's technically Ghost. It's Dark because he's got Sableye and Poison because he's got, um, Gengar. Water Electric, you think in, like, Lantern. Normal Dragon is Drompa. Psychic and Flying is Espatra. Psychic Fairy. Is that like Gardevoir? Water Fire, though. I don't know what water and what Pokemon's Water and Fire. Alolan Tropic is going to be the most annoying one to fight. Steel Rock is like Aggron. Fairy Grass is like, um, Rensicott. But. It should be fun. I think we have a decent um, setup. Once the f like once we're allowed to battle the first gym, I will be uh, showing off my team to the public. I do need to get my last member from Wise. I was going to do that, but he was busy, so I didn't get around to it and decided to stream. So we'll get that from Wise, and then we will go into uh, this Pokemon challenge. Hopefully, be able to win some prizes, because there's some neat prizes on there. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to go to bed. I don't think there's anybody uh, streaming tonight that I want to uh, send it over to. Looks like, uh, actually, I will list is streaming. So, raid I will list. All right, y'all have a good night, and we will catch you on the next one. Bye.